bottom here, uh, the Scholars. But they throw the ball from right to left. They go in field. This is Rob Oakley who steps off one foot and takes the tackle. They're last tackle. Ten metres short. Last tackle. What can they do? A bit more. Key areas that have proved that. The, the oh, lovely run there, and it's a try, there. is it? Yes, it's problem yep. number 17. Uh, yep. Terrific try there by Rob Oakley. It was a little bit of a second phase. What more for Crusaders do to set? This is Tyus once more. He got involved in the last few moments. And it's a lovely Oakley's run. It's an individual try there by Rob, Rob Oakley. That will score his second try. He deserved that. He got involved and he just walks his way. Right now, losing little play. Look at London outside. jumping all over that. They okay, lost now. the ruck. Nice play. Nice play, Ooh, Oakley, to see now, that. Switner on the back pedal here. They are indeed. Oakley with a run. Here now is uh, Meadows. Meadows gets it to Sam. The no look pass does. He go. wanted to open his hips and go looking for the player that was out the back. But he Two, didn't, and he, Ridyard were watching him in the back place, pointing at Zamet all through the sets. He's sending all his traffic there, but Zamet's handling it. He's more than ready for us. Well, here he is. Yeah, definitely. Obviously, you know, we're playing Whitehaven, we're playing Swinton. You know, this might these these two wins would help us get up the ladder before we play Featherstone. Then, As great job, like you said, they're low on middles, and he's you know he's been rewarded with a try as well. So I know about six or seven minutes time uh Foz, i'm gonna ask you to uh pick your bet fred play ringer of jesse jaws size before will he <laughs> don't think he'll ever have to do either as rob oakley then with the carriers guy graham's trying to steal the ball and rob gets to ground as davis jumps switch uh, josh over to the left hand side as london look to go on their own he's trying to pinch one there with the debutant rob oakley yeah he had a little look a little cheeky look and that's going to be another penalty as is Kirkland Oakley Oakley shows and he goes oh that was a bit nasty well old school tackle there by Kirkman he's been around long enough to do that money yeah but he's been a lot right back set and you know, hopefully we can get more points on the board that's frustrating I mean I know obviously the coach is next door next door to us what will you I mean we'll probably discuss it later if we get a chance but what will you learn so far from this display um, Brilliant oh, off ball off there board. to Oakley. Oakley Go gets through one. Go on, boy. Through it. Oh, and Dixon stops him. And it's oh, a, a penalty high, high shot. And uh, I think he's just got a cross. Looking for runners. The ball comes out the back door. How he managed to get that out, I do not know. But he did manage to offload it. And uh, eventually, John Davis comes in and wraps up the uh, London player. In the rook. Connor Jones in there. As London now get to the 40 metre line, that's good yardage work from London. They've managed to make some good metres there. And um, Scholars though in attack and they are showing some nice stuff. They've thrown this ball out wide and they're trying to create... So they're looking here to get an attacking end to the set. A couple of metres away. When Swindon are scrambling, they're doing it well. What can... Because they're keeping... London out of their own 40, no, which is not nice two. He's put right on the money. Is now a good oh, carries already go. for the Broncos. Uh, Newcastle 36 nil up now against Oldham. There's clear dummy hat by Jimmy there. Misky probably, Misky probably could have breached this defence matter. Yeah, definitely. I think it's it's quite early. Team B and. Uh, World Cup later this year for Wales. Six more, six more and wait by the referee. A, a set restart. This is Callum Hazard now. So Anthony Murray ringing the changes. Brennan Gibson once more. This is a great run by North Wales Crusaders. I think it's Jack Cottington who's wearing the 18 on his uh, back. Uh, All part of the teamwork and camaraderie. So um, London blew the chance of taking two points and come up with nothing. We're now in stoppage time at the end of the first half, of which I imagine... North Wales Crusaders have got some room. Have you got the pace to go all the way? Don't no, think he, he has, but the pressure has been eased, if you like, and it was a great interception by Ben Morris. He's been good. They can score tries. They've just got to stop making mistakes. And uh, North Wales, we've got three or four very experienced players who we have to treat carefully because they are going to be the players... That With a bit of determination. And here now, kill the Lions again. And it's Spencer again who carries the ball. Back ten off his own line. Not centre of the field. It's something probably about twenty to seven. Yeah, Whitehaven have not had the ball, have they? And when they've done, when they have had the ball, they just seem to keep knocking the ball on. 
and that is so it's picked up by White Lee it's an angled run Dean, Dean finds a teammate who's a 22 minute salvo by the Broncos another drive for the line can they, they stop him again this time it's a Marcus Stock that's to the left so then the Oxford Knights they've, they've battled valiantly but uh, that second half that's the touch judge thought he was uh, a little bit unlucky there to uh, have the ball taken off him and now it is Featherston have the ball remain Navarrete well in 11 league games so far this season Rovers have scored and uh, it is Luke Cooper that is eventually brought. <laughs> yeah, Rovers sit. Parada on a little gallop finds the support of Craig Kokchak again. Craig Kokchak is tackled posts. not only by the uh, London player. Hardcastle, the ball goes now to the hands of Gareth Gale. Gareth Gale, only one try today from Gareth Gale.